We have a patient with pregnancy test uh, and uh, as we can see in early sonography, we have at least four gestational sacs. One is here, the bigger one, a smaller one is on top of it and another one is here here is also at least four gestational sacs are seen inside the intrauterine cavity one two three and four this is the smallest one and uh, none of them has uh, heart rate or uh, fetus inside uh, because they are uh, small this one the second one and also here so uh, the biggest one is in diameter about Nineteen millimeter uh, compatible with six weeks of gestational age. Here, here, one and one here. So, how uh, can we understand uh, that these gestational sacs, especially the smaller one, are not subcoronic hematomas? And the key is that in subcoronic hematoma we do not have any decidual reaction but here we have a hyper echoic decidual reaction and also here the biggest one is so obvious the decidual reaction and also the second one in diameter also has decidual reaction so these are not uh, subcoronic hematoma and all of them are gestational sucks um, but we should wait till uh, the CRL and heart rate begins uh, that we can understand how many of these gestational sucks would uh, develop and become to complete pregnancy and uh, in future deliver the fetuses because the smaller one may be uh, become dead fetus and be absorbed and not seen in the later pregnancy.